I hired a professional cuddler. I didn't even know a professional cuddler was a thing. And are you okay if like I rub on your shoulder like towards your back? Mm -hmm. How, how do you get how do you get like a degree in this one? But like we all know I have a weird thing with physical affection. It's really not my thing. And I've been trying to get over like this, but it's, it's gonna be so funny. She's gonna be here like very soon. And I have no idea who she is or what she looks like. All I know is that I had to sign a waiver. I'm going in blind to this one. So who's excited? Uh, this girl is. Woo! <laughs> okay. <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> I'm like. <laughs> Hello. Hello! Welcome to my house! So I'm Anna. I'm Susan. May I give you a hug? Yes, of course. <laughs> Sounds like your dog would like a hug as well. I think you know, you might actually really love a hug. <laughs> Shoot, should we just like go jump in, jump into my bed? That sounds so wrong. Should we go upstairs? <laughs> um, yes, where, where would you like to begin? I would think cuddling would happen in a bedroom. So when did you start this whole professional cuddling thing? Um, I started back in 2016. I had just gotten out of a 12 year relationship. Oh wow. And I was like, uh, touch is my love language uh -huh. and I'm not ready to date. Yeah. And so like, how do I meet those needs? Uh -huh. And so a friend of mine's like, come to a cuddle. I'm like, what? How have I not known about yeah, cuddling? Yeah. And so the rest <sighs> is history. I was just like, whoa, this is amazing. Personally, me, yeah. I am like weird with physical touch. And that's, <laughs> so that's why we're here yeah. today is to get over that. Exactly. Or try to. Exactly. It's yeah. all about the consent piece okay. and learning to understand what your yeses and nos are uh -huh. and knowing that we're going to just take it moment by moment, step by step based on your comfort level. And I'm just going to keep checking in to see how you're doing with it. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> yes. Maybe let's start, are you okay with being on the floor since you have a nice cushy yeah, no, I'm for sure carpet okay here, that. you know, so we're not just immediately yeah, into no, that's kind of perfectly what your fine. I love private carpet. spaces. So let's start with what we call the oxytocin hug. Okay. And so we can do that seated here and then I'm gonna come around this way because then we can be heart to heart okay. where we can kind of sync up with our breathing. Mm -hmm. And what I'm gonna do, yeah. if you're open to it, mm -hmm. I'm gonna come around and hug you this way and we're just gonna hold each other. Okay. If you hold it for at least 20 seconds, mm -hmm. that's when you start to get that oxytocin moving. Right. You ready oxytocin. for this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ready to get this going? Okay. I think so. Beautiful. So All right. this way and then Yeah. And I'm just holding. And just breathe, you know? It's just a chance to feel what's going on within yourself. We notice if you're feeling anxious, what's going on with your breathing. And whenever you're ready, we can release. That was actually a really comfortable hug. I'm yeah. not gonna lie, I'm gonna pop yeah. my squat and hug people now. Let's try the back to back. Okay. To see what you think about that. And so basically use each other to prop each other up and, um, and breathe for a couple moments and notice what that's like. I don't know if I've sat back to back with someone. Yeah, I'm this is sure. another great like beginner pose because you don't have to face each other. It can be really intimidating to, to stare into each other's yeah. eyes, you know? Mm -hmm. um, so sometimes this is a good beginner one where you still have some touch, mm -hmm. but yet, you know, you're still in your own energy and space. I and like this one. <laughs> I like this I one a lot why, too. I forget I about it sometimes. I'm like, oh, what about back to back? Oh, oh, really leaning. And then go this way. And then we could even go forward and backwards. And we can release whenever you're ready. So what what are you noticing with that? 
I also like how it's like you're not looking straight on because yes. my thing is that's also very difficult for me to do is mm -hmm. like be super like face to face with someone. So let's explore another one if you're open to it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna move away so we can try other positions mm -hmm. and um, one that can be really nurturing like again you like being held from the back Yeah. Um, would be big bear baby bear we call it. And then um, what if I bring like my legs in closer? Go for it. I like this so you can get... Whoa, that was like a new level of comfort right there. <laughs> that was, yeah. I don't know if I've ever been in this position before either. I could totally understand when you just connect with like some part of yourself and you're just like, oh wow. Yeah. Gonna give all my love to Eddie today. It's his birthday and Aww. gonna go see him after this. He's just gonna be attacked with oxytocin drugs. Yes. Now how you doing with your comfort level? I'd say honestly probably like a six now. Ooh, okay. Mm -hmm. Getting some movement on that. Mm -hmm. And would you like to try something else? I don't know, cause this is pretty freaking comfortable. <laughs> yeah, you can hold it, yeah, as long as you want. Um, we could either do what is called koala bear, or we could do lap of luxury. Let's do the koala. koala. Yeah. Step out of here for a moment so you can get so just situated so where So I'm you're... on my back? Yeah, on and your back with your arms out. Arms out. And then I'll just come along maybe this side. And then um, I'm gonna put my head like in the crook of your shoulder there. Gotcha. And then you... Feel free to, if you want to, wrap your arms around me, whatever feels mm. comfortable for you. So now, how's your comfort level? Still probably say a six. Does it ever get weird for you? Generally, no, because even if it's like a new client, before I even book a session, we have a conversation. Mm -hmm. But I address those things up front that could be crossing the line, if you will, and things like that. Mm -hmm. <sighs> so are you wanting to try another position or how are you doing with this? Let's try the other one. What, what the, the lap of luxury? Yeah, that okay. one. Let's try that. Okay. And then um, I can bring my leg in like closer on your back to support you. For sure. That feels good. You no, know, yeah. And um, are you open to me, like, rubbing your hair and your head? Yeah, no. Nope. You open to trying that out? Mm -hmm. Okay. Don't know if I've ever been in this type of position. See, clearly I just haven't done any type of cuddling. And no, it's not common, which is really kind of sad to me in a certain way in our humanity that, that it's not common that we have experiences like that. Except maybe as a child, you mm -hmm. know, maybe this is something your mother or father did. Mm -hmm. And that's kind of what the energy is supposed to be like in a cuddle space. Mm -hmm. And are you okay if like I rub on your shoulder like towards your back? Mm -hmm. And are you okay if I hold your head while I do that? Mm -hmm. Just like hold at the top. Yep. Again, thank you. Thank you for trusting me to be a part of this experience for you. Well, thank you for opening up or expanding my comfort levels. You're welcome. Recap? Yeah. Feeling good, honestly. I didn't I didn't have any faith, faith that I was going to get off the ground with her. And we were just going to be sitting there next to each other the whole time. And then, you know what? Here we are. And that was pretty great. Yeah. I'm going to cut Pluto <laughs> yes. with what I just learned. <laughs> Dumbfounded as to what was happening. Why, Pluto? You don't want to cuddle with me? I don't even know how to explain the experience. A super nice lady, though. Rating out of 10, six or seven. Imagine if you were like, really going there so you could get something out of it. You would probably love that. Anyways, well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. 
Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell if you want to, and I will, we will see y'all in the next video. Deuces!